Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today's Friday, so you know what that means. Dollar Tree haul time. So let's get to some of the food stuff here. This is the cold stuff, so that way I can get it put away. These are, well, all, th all but one thing are repurchases. So um, son got two of these to have for lunch two different days it's these cheeseburgers the fast bites he really likes these um they're good you know nice and easy to fix and i got me two more of the fast bite breaded chicken sandwiches he got him another one of these brown and serve meals with the sausage pancakes and the little hash browns by banquet then the last cold item he picked up it's Echo Lake Foods. It's the buttermilk waffles. Oops. Oh, if I had to write that up, wouldn't it, guys? <laughs> As you can see there, it's 7.5 ounce. So he got those to try for breakfasts. So let me go put the stuff away and we'll get to the rest of the haul. All right, guys, so let's get into the rest of the food items. Um, I got this loaf of Wonder Bread. It's the 20-ounce loaf, so pick that up for a dollar. He had to have some more of his Mrs. Freshly's Swiss Rolls. It's the four 1.8-ounce packages, so he got that. And he had to get another thing of the Junior Dippers. Got the five cheese things with the breadsticks. And then, of course, his 16 count mini powdered donuts. Had to have that. And this time he picked up the glazed honey buns. Six individually wrapped ones. So he grabbed that. And then he wanted a bag of chips. And he said it's been a long time since he had any Funyuns. So he grabbed him a bag of those. It's the one and a half ounce bag of that. And I believe that does it for the food stuff. So now we get to get on to the fun stuff. So first thing I've got, repurchase. Because I picked it up last week, but they still had some. So I went ahead and picked up another. It's the four pack of the Mentos, the orange flavored ones. It's the four pack there. So I picked up another one of those. And he did some more of the training pads. The puppies, I always put one of these down, you know, if I know I'm gonna be gone for a considerable amount of time, like on Fridays when I'm gone shopping. So that way if they do need to go potty really, really bad, they go on this. So pretty good buy there. Um, let's see here. I got stuff everywhere, guys. I went a little crazy today. Um, this is, I mean, new, but it's just an Easter thing. It's the peanut butter egg. It's the white one, three ounce. Picked up one of those to share around. And then, uh, these always get so tangled up in the bags, guys. All right, I picked up this bunch of flowers, and it's the baby's breath. So I got that, and I got this one, too, if I can get it out of the dang bag. Losing flowers off of it, so kind of kind of looks like the lilacs. So, well, that's what it says. Lilacs, if I'd have read the tag. So these are going... <laughs> going for a DIY, so definitely watch for that. Hopefully it'll be coming soon, because I think I've got everything I need now. If the flowers would stop falling apart, I would anyway. Um, picked up this basket. New for me, but it's been at the store for a while, but my son picked it up. He's got some stuff that he wants to put in it. Um, yeah, it just says basket. I don't know what, what size it is, but yep. So, he got that. He's got some stuff he wants to put in it. 
And then again, this is it's new purchase for me, but it's not a new item to the store because I have seen them there before. And it is the Willow Wreath. And if you can see how this one is kind of egg shaped already, I thought it was perfect for the DIY that I want to do. So I grabbed that and this is actually thicker than the rest of them that were there and actually a little bit better, even though there's some, you know, things sticking out here and there, but it'll work. And I thought that was pretty cool. It was kind of almost egg shaped already. So that was perfect. And for the DIY, I also picked up this 10 count of the egg picks. Got five there and then five more at the bottom. <clears throat> and of course, not going to be using the sticks on these probably, you know, maybe some of them, but for my DIY, I won't. But found those and got them. And then I picked up these three ribbon. They're all nine foot long by five eighths of an inch wide. So I picked it up and it's really pretty sparkly blue. The pink and the purple. And I hauled the yellow last time. So I think that's everything I need for my DIY. Um, picked up another thing of the headphones. Mine shot crap on me. So picked up another one. And then again, this is not new to my store, but I finally broke down and had to get some. Everybody's been hauling stamps, stamps, stamps. And I finally decided I wanted to try to use these stamps. So this is the one I picked up. It says happy birthday. It's got the balloons and then the little um, banner thing there and the cake present party hat. And then I picked up one of the um, acrylic blocks. There's 30 by 3 acrylic block to go with it. And then a two-pack of the little ink pads. So, picked those up. Got on the bandwagon, I guess you could say. Um, this is not new, but we needed some more band-aids. I really do like these. They work really, really well. So, picked those up. And then I picked up another one of these. This is actually the last one that I saw at my store. So this one that's oblong like that. So I can do some more organizing. So pick that up. All right. And I think everything else is new. Like new to my store, new to me, everything. So um, these, they did not have, I don't think they had these colors last time. But I picked up these two LA colors. It's the color craze. You can see the colors. I don't know what the names of the colors are. Let me see if I can read this here. Sheer Frost. Just that one. It's really pretty blue. And this one is Sheer Kiss. Let's see that there. Really pretty. Really pretty like pastel kind of colors, so I thought those would be cute for spring and Easter. Let's paint my nails. Then, I finally had some of the doggone socks that everybody's been hauling. These are some of what they're called the shoe liners. I just call them no-shows. But it's, in, it's cute, almost like Aztec kind of pattern. They're really, really soft. So, excited to try those. And I've got this really pretty yeah, really bright peach color. So those were nice. I like those. <laughs> I got stuff behind me. Hold on, guys. Hush, you two. Dogs are excited. It's playtime. All right. So the last time I hauled these pyrolines, um, it was the chocolate ones. And I said that Madison had hauled the vanilla ones. Well, guess what I found? This week at my store. That's right. The vanilla ones. So I went ahead and grabbed two of them. Uh, the chocolate ones. Oh my gosh. They were delicious. So I have no doubt that these are going to be just as good. So cannot wait to try this. Um, saw this in there. 
in their travel section and went ahead and picked it up to throw in, you know, our stuff to take with us, you know, when we go camping and stuff or even on vacation or whatever. But it's the Charmin Fresh Matters to go and it's the 10 count wipes. It's in the little travel thing so you can throw it down in a purse or, or wherever. So I grabbed that and that was new. Look at that little one. And let's see here. And then they finally had the LED glow art. It's like the mini light bright. Let's see if I can open it here. Oh. Yep. There's the bag of the little the little things. And you open it up. And a piece of hyper stick to it. And there's the box and the bottom of it. It is in this really pretty teal color. Kathy, you would like this one. <laughs> Kathy Mova, no guts, no glory. She loves her teal and her owls. So there's that. That'll give my son something fun to play with. Um, Next, I finally found this. I was so excited. It's the Zoom Zoom tote bag. Isn't it cute? I just love these characters. I like Disney characters anyways, but there's something about them in this zoom zoom shape thing that just makes them even cuter. And then the size, you can see it kind of says zoom zoom there. But yeah, and it's, you know, Disney zoom zoom. So pretty, pretty excited to finally have the tote bag. What's the bottom look like? Bottom's just solid red. So was very excited about that. I love bags. Um, let's see here. More new stuff. Actually, some of this isn't like totally new. Um, let me get my stuff together here, y'all. Okay. Um, some of this is not new. I've actually hauled this before, uh, but it went into some friend mail. And I decided to pick up some more. I don't know whether I'm going to keep it all for me or... Maybe do a giveaway soon. I don't know. We'll have to see. But I picked up another one of these little uh, notebooks. And it is by the Crown Jewels Company. This is a 40-page. It says Happy Thoughts across the top. So I got that. Then I got another one of these. It's a 40-page. It says Take Notes. And it's got the two sets of lines on it. Like that on the back. And again, the Crown Jewels. This is all the same collection. Um, I got another one of these. It's a 50-page journal. It's got the Hello in the kind of foil copper colored. And it's got it down here on the bottom. Here's what the back looks like. Just striped. Crown Jewels again. And then I picked up another thing of the Puffy Stickers. The lightning bolt and the elephant, the pineapple and the diamond. Picked up another one of those. And I did not get these two last time. They did have them, but I just didn't pick them up. So they're not new to the dollar store, just new to me buying them. Um, and this is a 50-page little notebook. It's super, super cute. I really like it. It's got like a clear thing on the front. And it again, crown jewels. So pick that notebook up. And then this journal is, again, a 50-page journal. It says, Be Happy, Be You. And it's just the, the ombre on the back, too. And, again, crown jewels. Okay. And then these bags, again, not new. They had them there last time. I just only picked up one. I picked up another one this time, but I picked it up in this pink this time. It's kind of a mauve kind of color almost. So, but it's that really nice, like, Almost suede kind of bag. So it just says cosmetic bag. So I picked up the pink one of that because I have addiction to makeup bags too. I don't know why. Okay. And then these two things I found, and they actually had two different kinds. Um, the way it looks, you know, they kind of had the same things, but the <coughs> notebook. <coughs> All right, guys. Sorry about that. My middle son came home and I wasn't expecting him. So back to what we were doing. 
I found these notebooks. This one says, today is going to be really great. And that is just so pretty. I love the colors. You know, this coral and the, the teal. Just beautiful. And it's Anna Davis for Crown Jewels. And it's just, you know, the lined little notebook, kind of almost journal-like. Um, so I picked that up. I just thought it was cute. I like notebooks and stuff, too. <laughs> and then this one says, Believe and it will be. So there's that one. It's got little gold accents on it there. And again, this is Ann Davis for Crown Jewels. And it is just the lined notebook. So, but what I mean by it, they had they had several other designs with other sayings and stuff, but these were my favorite ones. So I picked these. But the other ones that they had were almost more of a, a rounded on the bottom. You know, they were flat across the top, but they were rounded and opened up this way as opening up that way. So I liked those two, so that's what I picked up. You know, I really wanted to pick up every single one of them so that way I could show them to you guys. But I didn't. That was good. All right. Now, last set of stuff that I got. Hold on just a second, guys. All right. Now on to the best part. But I got to start going to my Dollar Tree a little sooner. <laughs> like maybe on Tuesdays or Wednesdays instead of waiting until Fridays. I found some of the Bolero stuff. A lot of it was already gone. I mean, seriously, almost cleaned out. <laughs> so I did find this three pack of the English Rose Blossom bath bombs. And I also found the, just one, this was the last bath fizzer that they had of any of the scents. And it was in the English Rose Blossom, which is, I'm, I'm glad, because that was the scent I was most looking forward to. Um, I wasn't going to pick up any of the body creams, but I did have to go ahead and get one of the English Rose Blossom. So, got that one. And then I picked up two of the facial wipes. This is what I wanted the most, because I love these Valero face wipes. And this is what I was looking forward to the absolute most was these. So I picked up two of the English Rose Blossom ones. Um, I picked up one in the Lavender and Citrus. And these are all 30 counts, just like the last time. But I feel they're a little shorter than, than the, the uh, vanilla cream ones back there at Christmas time. So, but there's still 30 of them in there, though. And then the last face wipe I did pick up was the Italian pear. They actually had that. They didn't have any of the Moroccan mint. So um, they did have the Italian pear bath bombs, the three pack of the little bath bombs. I picked up one of those. They had very few of these left too, guys. I'm trying to think if this was about what all they had for the bath bombs. And then I did pick up the Moroccan mint and raspberry in this but this is about all they had besides i think like the body oil and then the bar soap and i just didn't need those then the last few things here they had the big bath bombs i picked up two in the vanilla and wild berries mm, and they smell so so good so i picked up two of those because those were my favorite ones then I did get one of the pink grapefruit and sugar cane. It doesn't, it doesn't smell too bad. It doesn't smell too bad. Probably should have picked up another one of those. But I didn't. And this one was kind of my least favorite scent. It's the coconut and verbena lime. And I just, it wasn't the greatest. So I just, I just picked up one of them. One of them to have. So that is my haul guys like i said i mean this is what i was most excited about was the blero face wipes and the next was the mini bath bombs i really didn't think i was going to find any of this stuff at my store especially not this quick so 
it's a long haul today guys sorry about the long video but i went a little went a little crazy i did i'll admit it i'm guilty but anyways it was fun i got a lot of good stuff i think i've got everything i need now for my diy so be watching for that hopefully next week and we will see you guys next time bye